we praise you that today we can gather and pray and join with people all over the world calling out to you in the country of Congo. Lord, it's you who created this land rich with oil and minerals and you're the one that created all the different creatures in its rainforests. You're the one that gave it all its farming and agricultural potential. But more than that, you created a people. You created people that you loved, the people that you have compassion on, people that you want to know you. Lord, we praise you for the diversity in Congo, 80 different ethnic groups, 66 languages, 4 million people. Yet, Lord, we know it's a country that's been through so much, even difficult civil war in the 90s, still trying to recover. Lord, we recognize today that people are suffering, but Lord, you hear and you see all things under the sun, and we know you have compassion. We know that Congo has a difficult, corrupt government that doesn't always govern the way that you want. And so we're praying for wise governance so that the people could live peaceful and godly lives. Lord, we know that Congo needs you. They need Jesus, the one who saves. And so, Lord, we're asking that your spirit would be poured out on that nation. Lord, we're asking specifically for the church that you would revive that church. We thank you for the good work you did. 1920 to 1960, so many people coming to you. And, and yet, Lord, today we see a very, very thin covering over a lot of tribal religions called Christianity. But Lord, you're not the God who wants to share your glory with anyone. So we pray, God, that you would raise up a true church from within Congo that would be totally devoted to you, the one true God. Lord, we're praying for those that would be translating the Bible, 13 active translation projects. Lord, give people strength, help them organize their time, protect them from any distractions. And Lord, help them to do work with excellence for you and for you alone. Lord, we're praying for the least reached, that you would raise up workers. You told us to pray that, that you would raise up workers. So we do, and we join with people all over the world and pray that you would raise up workers. You'd send workers from outside of Congo, workers from inside Congo. Lord, raise up workers to go and extend real love, genuine love of God to people that don't even know that Jesus loves them yet. Lord, we're praying for the Jesus film, we're praying for radio ministries and any other tools that you want. You're a creative God, but Lord, our prayer is that your love and your salvation would reach deep into Congo. And we're asking for these things that we believe are according to your will. Extend your mercy, Lord. Advance your kingdom. In Jesus' name.